right, welcome, welcome to Elden Ring. First time, well, no, not the first time. I believe I started a character before. And actually, okay, welcome to the online. And like, let's see, it's like 8:26. Um, whoa. Okay, jeez, all right. So I got alarm for 30 minutes from now. I'm actually about to cook a pizza, so we'll do this in like, yeah, 30 minute things, but. Oh, so I have continue, let's do new game. So this will be all fresh. Like this is a fresh playthrough. Yeah, I think I've done something like that, but I'm gonna just do warrior. Uh, there we go. Um, now the keepsake, I don't know. Like, if there's something they can upgrade. So that might be something, Bewitching Branch. It might be like, say, two stone keys, she like sort of. Huh. Let's see, I think, I don't know, Cracked Pot sounds good, and then the ashes of small. I don't know. There you go, Golden Seed. So that enhanced Sacred Flask, so that's going to be like the SS Flask or your healing item. And then, yeah, so Golden Seed. Um, uh, I, I'm okay with any of that. I don't, I don't really ever see the character all that much, so, oh, name. Uh, uh. A Rai. <laughs> All right. Starting game with this character. Yes. Please and thank you. type monster. The Ooh. mad taint of their newfound strength triggered the shattering. A war from which no lord arose. A war Leading to abandonment by the greater will. It's just so epic. Oh, rise now, ye tarnished, ye dead who yet live. 
the call of long lost grace speaks to us all. Horalu, chieftain of the Badlands, the ever brilliant Gold Mask. Fear. The Deathbed Companion. The Loathsome Dung Eater. And Sir Gideon Othnir. The All-Knowing. It's like the typical lineup. It tells you like some of the main bosses, but not all of them. I mean, usually. And I imagine this game, I've heard it's really, really, really long, so... And one ah. other, whom grace would again bless. A tarnished of no renown. Cross the fog to the lands between. To stand before the Elden Ring and become the Elden Lord. All right. Yeah. First thing you got to do, roll around. Let's usually get these things. Tarnished wizened finger. <coughs> so I wonder if that isn't like the multiplayer summon. Okay, so. So yeah, so light attack I think is R1, heavy is R2. Ooh. It's a two-handed and then yes, yeah, it's oh. Okay. This is gonna be confusing. Usually it's like X and square. Oh, and it's super loud. <laughs> Usually it's X and square. Ooh, Chapel of Anticipation. And usually there's like a, yeah, uh, a gnarly boss in the very beginning of these things. All right, so then you hold circle down to run. Oh, there's like nothing back here. Be wary of Cliff. You know, just gotta think of like, if you were designing the game, where would you hide things? Like, there you go, but that's probably locked. So there's like a shortcut. So then, oh, yeah, that's pretty cool. There you go, that looks like something. Nope. Whenever you can double back, you generally want to at least like try it, just kind of see. Whew! Yeah, don't fall off of that. All right, so I guess we're going down the rickety bridge. What are people saying? Be wary of rump. Yeah, this looks like a total boss fight. And I feel like I have just done this. Yeah, no item ahead. That's right. And in fact, we'll go to double check just to be sure. But I remember coming back and being like, oh, there's nothing. And then... Ah. Could this be a sniping spot? 
yeah, so like it's a bit of a disappointment. Although, oh, that's right, then you can see the enemy area, but don't get too attached because <laughs> we're pretty much just gonna get worked like right away. Like, there's no way to really beat this boss. Or I say that, but maybe there is because, like, I know Bloodborne, there's a werewolf in the very beginning that you beat. Um, you can beat it pretty easily once you like are used to playing the game, but this. Oh, uh, one shot? Are you kidding me? I was actually doing pretty good there. All right, all right. And actually, now that I think about it, I wouldn't be surprised if I've already uploaded a video of me starting out Elden Ring, but we're doing it again. We're doing it as a Rai. Uh. Because this is the first time on the PS5. His kind is sure to seek the Elden Ring. Oh, but of course, but of course. Violate the Golden Order. Oh, we'll violate it. I'm surprised we haven't violated it already. <laughs> uh, sorry. Oh, I'm so excited. Another Souls game. And the graphics are just so unreal. Like, I was just talking about, like, Goldeneye and stuff, and then looking at this stuff. I don't know, water. Flask of Crimson Tears. Okay. Flask of Cerulean Tears. All right, so that's, like, health and, yeah, health and mana. Jump down the hole ahead and you'll find the Cave of Knowledge there. You can learn more about game controls and basic actions. Um, no thank you. Let me talk to... Alright, take the plunge. I don't know, I don't know. <laughs> the Cave of Knowledge lies below. Tarnished ahead. Alright, you, you know what? Let's, uh, let's do it. Oh! Alright, so now we know that that is heals. First off, strong foe. Restoring at a site of grace will restore your HP, FP. Yeah, FP is like your mana. Then cleanse any status ailments. It'll also refill your sacred flasks. However, most of the enemies you've defeated will be revived. You can find sites of grace by going where light converges. These explanations are acquired in the form of info items and can be accessed from the inventory at any time. Whew. Oh, I'm going to touch the grace. Schwung. Lost grace discovered. No enemy ahead. I'm going to say good. Wait. How did, how did I do good? Um. <laughs> I'm pushing down. Like, down arrow. I don't want to say poor. Anyways, whatever. Oh, 
Oh yeah. You got a hold for the heavy attack. Yeah. First you gotta time it right. Yeah, and rolling to dodge. <laughs> yeah, super hard enemy. Is that a thing to pick up? Oh, okay. Oh, acquire materials. In every corner of the lands between, you'll find fruits and flowers, mushrooms and butterflies, and various other useful materials. These materials can be used for item crafting. Okay, so... Likely horse. Okay. Come on. Acquire the materials. Oh. oh. How about the... Yeah, so I had to like get behind the shield and get at him. So, you know, your classic Dark Souls game. Oh. See, I can't. I can't. <laughs> Like, I don't know what else that could be. I mean... Yeah, that, the trackpad's the map. Try rolling. I mean, that is always a good suggestion in Souls games. Ah. Okay, well, he's... No longer an issue, but I feel like there's probably items throughout there. Skills. Armaments have special abilities called skills. Skills are highly varied and range from power attacks to temporary effects. Us using skills consumes FP. So my L2. Okay. So like focus points, maybe? I gotta stop crouching. Oh. Crouching, crouching. <laughs> To make it harder for enemies to discover you, especially effective in tall grass, attacking an enemy that hasn't noticed you will cause more damage than usual. Crevasse. Stance breaking. Some attacks may break an enemy's stance, giving you a chance to perform a critical hit. Charge attacks and jump attacks make it particularly easy to break an enemy's stance. All right. Whatever. Kill him. Stakes of Marika. Oh, upon dying, you'll be revived at the last site of grace that you visited. <clears throat> However, if there is a stake of Marika near where you died, you can choose to be revived there instead. Okay. Hello. Oh. You can perform a counterattack immediately after blocking an enemy attack. Guard counters make it easy to break an enemy stance immediately after blocking an attack. Guard counter. Oh. 
<laughs> There's no chance. I don't, I don't care. Zero Fs given. Phew. All right. <laughs> I'm out. All right. So now we're on the other side. This is what items look like, I guess. Ah! Strength. Alright, so... How do I do... Ooh, there's the inventory and all that, and then... Gestures. There we go. Oh, and my pouch. Memory of Grace. Oh, no, 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 no. I don't want to do any of that. Anyways. We're good. Now we can move on to the next area. <clears throat> okay. This is like a grace thing. Huzzah, yes. Breaking pottery. The main point of these games. Use Tarnish Furled Finger to write a gold summon sign. Cooperative multiplayer will begin once you have been summoned by a player from another world. You will take the role of an ally, Furled Finger, and your objective is to defeat the area boss. The compass at the top of the screen indicates the direction of the summoner, host of fingers. Alright, so now I've got Finger Severer. What? Tarnished furled finger. All right, so now basically what that means is if we go to, I think it's equipment. Yeah, then you can go to here, do this thing. So now, oh, but I can't do it. So this is how you heal, this is how you do your FP, and this is how you do the, the co-op, but you must be like in a certain area, I imagine. All right. You always want to try to do stuff like that. <laughs> like levers like that, I imagine. Ooh. In fact, that's a probably a, an elevator. Behold, liar. Yeah. Also, like, there's usually illusionary walls. In certain places. But maybe not. so scared ah well done okay <laughs> yep just gotta be sure limb grave oh and that guy <laughs> Looks like trouble. Yeah, got some feathers. Don't you dare. <laughs> All right. So I'm going to go talk to that one guy I saw, but not mess with the guy on the horse. Yeah, I've definitely been here before starting out a game, but I think that was on the PS4 maybe. All right, let's see. The map. Use your map to check your current position as well as the terrain and surrounding structures. You can update your map with new information by finding map fragments and steels or steles along the road. You can also use the map to freely place beacons of light to serve as landmarks as you explore. Oh, wait, wait, wait. So wait, that is the map. Hello. Oh, yes. Tarnished, are we? 
come to the lands between for the Elden Ring? Hmm? Of course you have. No shame in it. Unfortunately for you, however, you are maidenless. Without guidance, without the strength of runes, and without an invitation to the round table hold, you are fated, it seems, to die in obscurity. Hmm. Okay. Luckily for you, however, there is one shining ray of hope for even the maidenless, me, Vare. Take care to listen. Are you familiar with grace? The golden light that gives life to you tarnished. You may also behold its golden rays pointing in a particular direction at times. That is the guidance of grace. A path that a tarnished must travel. Hmm, indeed. Grace's guidance holds the answers. It will lead you tarnished to the path you are meant to follow, even if it leads you to your grave. Grace's guidance will to Castle Storm, the home mm. of the decrepit demigod, mm. Godric the Drafted. It's time you set off to Castle Stormvale if you seek the Elder. It's time you to Castle Stormvale. Okay. Well, we can gather these things. It's usually X too. Alright, another flight pinion. Ooh, that looks like nothing I want to deal with. Well, hmm. I'm going to wander around for a little bit. Like I said, avoid that guy because that guy's just going to kill me. <clears throat> Let's go try to fight one of these like bat winged things. I made a summon sign. Oh well. Uh, vanquishing enemy groups. Oh, there's the alarm, so I guess that's a. Uh, 
The first episode of Elden Ring, and let's actually cancel summon sign. Okay. So, all right, that was fun. We killed our first couple of enemies. It hurt. Um, let's go kill these uh, these eagles real quick. Hmm. And yeah. So, looks like there's some, like, dogs. Hmm. <laughs> Let's see, what's this thing? I got a horse's skull. Alright, anyways. Until next time. See you then.